the Leader of the Opposition. Oh, thanks, thanks, Mr Acting Speaker. Order. 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 The Leader of the Opposition has the call. The Leader of the Opposition. Thank you, Mr Acting Speaker. I refer the Prime Minister to his hopeless attack on fight back at um, the press club today. Order. The leader, ask, the leader will get to the question. I ask the Prime Minister, if you are so confident about your view of fight back, why won't you call an early election? Order. The, the answer is, mate, mate, because I want to do you all. slowly. I want to do you slowly. No, no. I know. There's got to be a bit of sport in this for all of us. No, no. There's got to be a bit of sport in this for all of us. And in the psychological battle stakes, we are stripped down and ready to go. Ready to go. And uh, I want to see those ashen face performances, more of them. I want to be encouraged. I want to see you squirm out of this load of rubbish over a period of months. There's going the to be no Aston. easy execution for you. No easy execution for you. You've perpetrated one of, the, one of the great mischiefs on the Australian public with this thing, trying to rip away our social wage trying to rip away the, the, the Australian the values Aston. which we built in our society for over a century. And if you think I'm going to put you out of your misery quickly, you can think again. The honourable member for Rich, the, the deputy leader has a, 